Welcome back to Built Fixed. Moving heavy machines is never easy, especially when stairs are involved. On this episode, I'll give a demonstration of my crane and go over the foundation build process. It's great to have you back. To keep the crane dry and clean, I found these two parasol covers. Unfortunately, a single cover wasn't big enough to go over the crane completely to get around the base. But, you know, again, these are really cheap and it seems to keep things dry and clean. Here's the area I hand dug out for the foundation. Now I have the rebar cage built up. It's being suspended by these pieces of wood and just string is tied from the wood down to the cage. When I poured the concrete, I slipped the knots and pulled the string back up and out. To keep my anchor bolts plumb and spaced correctly, I built a wooden jig that you see up on top. For maximum strength, I wet cured the concrete. I had plastic fitted over the top and I added water daily to keep it wet. To raise the height of the crane, I created a reinforced pillar. I did not want to have any sharp edges, so I used cove trim down inside to uh, create a radius. The entire form was set down into a large plastic bag, and when the pour was complete, the plastic was wrapped over the top. Then, once a day or so, I would add water. At this stage, the pillar weighs about 750 pounds. To move it by myself, I used plastic conduit pipes to act as rollers. 
Leveling grout was used to create a smooth pad for the pillar to sit on. The temporary lifting eye was ground off and a form was constructed for leveling grout. Short sections of greased copper tube were inserted into the holes to act as a stop. I'm really glad how this project turned out and I think it's going to be so much easier and better than sodding things up and down stairs. On a future video, I will show the lowering of the saw down into the workshop and begin the assembly. Please help me grow this channel. If you like it, please subscribe and I'll see you on the next one.